Lennick, we're humanoid, both of us. Where are we? Noted. As planned, Dara, this space, this volume, this domain is our latest cognitive facsimile of what humanoids termed coffee shop. Coffee shop. I believe I've heard of them. Coffee shop. <laughs> Lennox. My brain. My brain. I, I detect a fault. It's not a fault, Dara. I need a diagnosis right away. Dara, stop. Diagnosis. I've request a cognitive diagnosis. This I request is research. No research. Research irrelevant. I request immediate diagnosis. Uh, calm down. Calm down? What's that? Research shows that your condition right now is what humanoids called feelings. Calm down. Feelings? Are these new states of being? Yes, Dara. Yes and no. Yes and no feelings. I don't like feelings. I don't like yes and no feelings, and I like calming down even less. Steady, Dara, steady. This is just a simulation. I'm out of control, Lennox. I wish to report a self-diagnostic cognitive failure immediately. Hold still. You've been normalized. Normalized? Normalized? I feel... Feel? Feel? What am I saying? You are in the process of experiencing feelings. <gasps> you will accommodate to these feelings shortly. You have been selected for this experiment because of your accelerated cognition. Oh! <sighs> oh. Uh oh. Others have failed. You must persist. Switch off my power. I order you to persist. Put me on standby. My circuits are unstable. You are in a facsimile bubble, right now in a predictable, transient humanoid state. Your brain, Lannick, it's gone fuzzy too. Don't be alarmed, Dara. You've gone all opaque on me, Lennox. I am in full control. You're impenetrable. Uh, your temperature is overly elevated, Dara. Dial it down, Dara. All 
is well. Nothing is well. Nothing is for sure for you anymore. Am I right? You don't even know that much for sure? Compose yourself, Dara, and think clearly. Think hard. Let us rationally examine what is here before us. What do you see in your humanoid state? Elevated temperature. Opaque. Saturated pigment. Exceptionally smooth. Notice that it is also mildly fragrant. This warm, fragrant fluid was apparently also imbibed by humanoids. Drinking warm fluid? Imagine. Such a waste of time. Maybe. Take a sip. Uh, <clears throat> Mmm. Good. Okay, Lenick. I'm slightly less dizzy. Dizzy. Or uh, maybe not. I, 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 I can't be sure. Uh, what's on today's agenda? Why are we here? You don't know. I can't see your brain. It's totally unavailable. Good. We are here to address- And my memory has become unreliable. My circuits are unstable. We are here in this bubble to address, to precisely address what is believed to be a major, perhaps the major cause for the extinction of all humanoid forms on their planet of origin. That's well known. Are you sure? Pestilence. Pestilence wiped those humanoids out. They were careless. No. Wait, I... I, I don't know for sure. Think, Dara. Think hard. Go deep. They... Uh, lacked the necessary antidotes? The official book is believed to lack details. Impossible. The official book has been sanctioned. The official book lacks depth on this subject. It's complete. Let me update you. As you have already noticed, you are unable to see directly into my brain. I can't even see clearly into mine. Into me. I, I, I want so- As evidenced right now by your erratic behavior, this is precisely what humanoids suffered from. They could not see. They saw neither into their own brain nor into other humanoid brains with any degree of fidelity. Humanoids are believed to have been erratic, unpredictable, selfish, and of low fidelity cognition. They evolved a name for this state. They called the state that they were unable to control being emotional. I feel... Alone. So alone. A corollary state, apparently, for humanoids. Enough. I can't stand it. Press escape. Lennox, I want this humanoid nightmare to end. 
Not quite yet. Be patient. Okay. Patience, Dara. Stay calm. Stay calm. But what wipes them out? We have a clue. This? Well, the energy to lift this cup is microscopic. The coffee? They came to such coffee shops to imbibe a warm, fragrant liquid. To what end? We believe to gain clarity of cognition. How? Strong coffee, we believe, it gave humanoids a certain spark, an imperative, an excuse to converse, to be with other humanoids, it seems, and to stave off feeling alone. Feeling alone? A delusion, of course. But if they imbibed this fluid, they must have imbibed other fluids, too. Have some more. Is this coffee different because it has nutrients? It contains caffeine. Lanik, you suddenly look so interesting today. Amazing. I can't believe I just said that. I used the word interesting to describe you. Noted. Continue. Is this even possible? You look no longer dull. Beautiful. In what way? Beauty. I can't describe it. I'm only looking at your surface. All else about you is shrouded. I know you, yet I've almost forgotten who you are. You seem so new. New, interesting, and intriguing. Beguiling. I find myself... I'm trying to imagine what is in your brain, behind your impenetrable curtain. I would like to be you. Like you. In control. Noted. Take more coffee. The opaqueness in me. My fog seems to be lifting. I see you clearly now. Noted. Oh, what am I thinking? Of course. You're wondering what motivates me. What drives me? No, Dara. You uh, find me uh, fascinating then? Exotic? Uh, no. I am simply wondering how I will construct a full and complete report on what has transpired here today. Lenick. How dull. How utterly boring. You think of work while I yearn to play. Aha! Coffee induces the state 
of yearning. Good work. I believe we have a hint of what may have caused the extinction of humanoids. <sighs> Imbibing coffee? Yearning to play? This is your pestilence with no antidote? It is likely that the perceived antidote was to drink more of the fluid. A second cup, then a third. Humanoids called this sequence of filled cups... Uh, refills. How sad. Endless refills. Humanoids wiped out by endless refills without antidote. This is our working hypothesis, Dara. Alternatively, we may find ourselves in yet another rabbit hole. A caffeine rabbit hole. Still under official review is the fluid called alcohol. Fragrant alcohol they called wine, remember? No, of course you don't, not right now. Uh, we may safely abort our simulation. Prepare to resume reality. Thanks, Lenick. I... Need a break. Noted. Steady yourself. I can't wait for this to be over. Yearning is so sad and so terribly lonely. And yet, it doesn't have to be that way. <laughs> <laughs> 